Hold your horses. Are you really going to leave without Goal? Goal is safe. You don't have your facts straight. Bring the girl. Goal! You're back to being yourself. But how did you get here? Well, where's the other Rufus? I have no idea what you're talking about. What do you mean? Who cares what's going on in that convoluted brain of his? Goal was never dead. There was actually an accident with a defective interrogation robot. But of course, we were able to save her. We threw the robot overboard. And that other woman, that Donna. But Hermes. And now that everything is settled, hand over the ascension codes, or your girlfriend will really be thrown from the tower. Oh crap! Her dead body was thrown from the cruiser, along with me. You appear to be suffering from hallucinations. And I mean now. Listen to me, will ya? I know that the third Rufus is still out there. So what? It can be fixed. You always say that. In your whole life, you've never fixed anything. Face it, will you? He's going to fail as well. Just like you. So apologize. And then we can finally carry on. Apologize? For what? Do you really not know? Do you have no idea what you do to your friends? Again and again and again? Is this really necessary now? I think we have more important things to do. No, no, no. He needs to learn his lesson. So, Rufus, we're waiting. You're only attempting to humiliate me! Don't try to wriggle out of this one. It's time that you took responsibility for your actions. So? Do it. We're waiting. All of this happened because of the way you raised me. There you go again. Passing the blame. You are completely and utterly unable to learn anything at all. You will always be the same loser that you were as a child. Loser child. I'm not a loser. And I'm perfectly capable of learning. Prove it then. Go ahead. Apologize. I only wanted to help. Don't give me that. You only wanted to help yourself. I founded the resistance for one thing, and I'm perfectly capable of learning. No, you didn't. You just used them to impress Goal so she would take you to Elysium with her. And not even now, after you have killed her, can you admit that you failed. Will Deponia really have to explode before you realize that you are harming everybody? Cut him some slack there, will ya? It's not his fault that the Organon intends to blow up Deponia. Maybe not, but having his way is obviously more important to him than preventing the destruction of the planet. That's not true at all. Prove it then. Go ahead. Apologize. We're waiting. I am definitely not going to apologize. Oh, yes you are. I will drag you by the ears if I have to. Do you really have to lay into him like that? We all saw it. He messed it up. So why are you being so cruel to him now? I want to hear it from him. Go ahead, Rufus. Apologize. We're waiting. We're waiting. Fine. So we wait. The third Rufus can still turn the tide. And once he's succeeded, you can apologize to me. Huh. You sickening son of a... Oh! Hey! Seagull, what are you doing? This is really going too far. Put down the weapon. Yes. Wouldn't he like that? I've had it with this little bastard leading me by the nose. I demand to hear an apology now. Loud and clear, I said now. All right, all right. I apologize. What? Why did you do that? Trust me, we should apologize. You got something in your eye? I am beginning to lose my patience with a pair of you. With me too? But why? He's the one to blame for everything. He's got Gold's fate on his conscience. <laughs> yeah, and much more than that. He drugged cats. Hey, hands off. That's exactly what I'm talking about. He's always causing trouble. He stole everything that wasn't nailed down. He laid waste to half of Kuvak. 
I said hands off! You see, it's all his fault. And yes, it's his fault that... That's enough! Mom died. So, what's it going to be? Will you give me the codes? Don't give them to him! But he'll have you tossed from the tower! One of us has to make it to Elysium! I can't be responsible for your death again! I didn't like it one bit the last time! What nonsense are you talking now? Are you going to do it? In the meantime, I could easily have made myself another copy of the cartridge. What? You didn't really think I hadn't stored the data anywhere else. It's called a backup. Well, I had always asked myself what was going to be your last crucial mistake, Rufus. I think I know now. Open, boss. Throw the woman from the tower. But... Less contradicting, more woman throwing. Ah! No! <clears throat> Surprise! So you thought you could escape me, huh? What for? What good would it do? No idea. Buy some time? Time! Time! Time for what? Well, I I'm sure the third Rufus has a plan. You're acting like a baby. Just face it! Rufus number three screwed it up, and so did you! Rufus number three didn't screw it up! Huh? What's that? Oh, my baby phone is ringing. Uh, yeah, hello? I screwed up! Oh, I see. Uh, right, thanks. Um, that was Rufus. He, he said he screwed it up. <laughs> what do you know? Here we go. Hey, hey, what's the big idea? Hey! Hey! Ah! 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 Darn it, this hurts! I told you, I'm driving. And now, let's vamoose. Come on, don't make yourself so heavy. We've still got work to do. I'm afraid you'll have to do it without me. I'm not gonna make it. What are you talking about? Of course you'll make it! No, sorry. He hit me pretty badly after all. You're on your own again now. Promise me that you'll save Gold and Deponia and that you'll make it to Elysium. Do it. <coughs> do it for me. Hang in there. You can make it. No, it's too late. It's so dark. You need to stay awake. Do you hear me? Don't give up now. Don't worry about me. I'll be all right. Just as long as they don't make me repair junk presses on the other side. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I know. I'm way cool. <laughs> <laughs> Is this gonna take much longer? I don't want to seem unromantic, but we've still got a few gigantic... Uh, that's it, I guess. You finally succeeded in killing everyone after all. The cannon was our last chance, and now it's plugged up. We are all going to die. And it's all your fault. 
Thank you so very much, Rufus. Stop that! You should be ashamed of yourselves. Are you serious about blaming Rufus? Where would you be without him now? Likely still at home in Kuvak or the floating black market. Everyone doing their own thing. You wouldn't even have looked up when the bomb towers opened their hatches. It was him who brought you here. He fought for you and your planet. Even though you all hate him, he could have gone to Elysium with me on several occasions. But he didn't because he refused to sacrifice Deponia to get his way. And now you will damn him for doing the same thing for Elysium! Goal? <gasps> Goal! You're alive! And looking good. And, and you're alive! But... But why? Wh wh where have you been? It's a long story. But at the end, Argus threw me from the top of the Upper Ascension Station. Rufus, well, one of the Rufuses, jumped after me. And he caught me just before I hit the ground. Then he lost control of his flying robot thingy and crashed. Fortunately, I fell off and managed a soft landing on a burrito stool. May I interrupt you briefly? Despite this joyful reunion, hello, Bull. Tony, we are still doomed to die, remember? Leave him be, Tony. It doesn't matter. There's nothing left for us to do. I refuse to believe that. There must be another way. What are you looking at me for? My plan was using the cannon. Do you really think I would have considered that if I had seen another way? If it's a plan you want... You'll have to ask Rufus. Are you serious? Goodbye, cruel world. Ah, oh, Doc. I don't know. There are so many things I've messed up in the last couple of days. Of course Rufus has a plan. Yeah, I have... What? A plan. What else? A shiny, ingenious, and super-duper plan. His best so far. And it starts with a P, right? Okay, okay now. A plan. Come on, Rufus. You're good at this. You are super, super, super. Oh, darn it. No, you're not. You screwed up everything. Seagull was right. The elevator is gone, and Deponia will be blown to bits. No plan in the world can stop it. A plan! A Such a loop. A plan! A plan! Right. I am such a loser. Don't you have an idea or two? I've tried, Rufus. I'm sorry. You were right. The plan to shoot Elysium out of the sky was sheer madness. Anyway, the cannon's plugged by the tank now, and I am out of ideas. But you've got to think of something. You're the real tinkerer here. You're wrong, Rufus. I may be tidier, more precise, more reliable, more skilled, and quite a bit smarter than you. But this is not the time for prudent action. If there ever was a right moment for a rash act of desperation, then it is now. But he's right, Rufus. You can do it. Only a madman can save us now, and that's where you come in. Exactly. What we need now isn't just another crazy Rufus maneuver. We need the most absurd plan you have ever hatched. No more and no less than the ultimate maneuver. Come on, Rufus. You'll think of something. I believe in you. You know... That was totally swell of you to save me. Please, don't remind me. Think of something else, and fast. You're usually overflowing with ideas. Now come on, show us what you've got.
Why not? Well, you never know what it's like to talk to anyone. Why don't we got the loot? Do it that sure way. beats not having a plan. <laughs> It won't get any better if you keep fiddling with it. The wig is a little singed. So what? Be glad at least that the costume survived Oppenbot's fall. Oh yeah, yippee. That way, I was able to pilfer the clothes from my own corpse. I can barely restrain myself from jumping for joy. <sighs> Don't you think this is the wrong moment to turn into a sissy? It's all right. For all I care, we can get started. Well then, onward, onward to, Elysium. to Elysium. And here we go. Huh? Nothing's happening. Did you check the cables? I thought the dock had seen to that. I have to do everything myself around here. Oh, a little air, at last. Can you move over a bit? Who's him? Ah. Shut up back there. Rufus needs to concentrate. And here we go. Huh? Nothing's happening. Did you check the cables? I thought the dock had seen to that. I have to do everything myself around here. Can you check whether anyone's standing on the cable? Not me. Me neither. It must be you, Moo. Don't be silly, woman. Perhaps you, Doc? I don't know. I can no longer feel my legs. Uh, I think it's me. That's not the cable. Barry! Wait, I found the problem. I just need to lift the sandbag somehow. That is me. Oh, uh, it should work out. Thank you. This is it! <laughs> the final maneuver proved as a move no more nice as any other plan there was at hand. A perfect occasion for a contemplation of all the events and the writer's intent. It may seem sad to say that Rufus's way for saving the day is a little snapper. But when shit hits the fan, it's when a decent man's plan put in a deeper as ever a diver was a scuba to do. Was a scuba to do. Uh-oh. That's what I like about you. You always find a place to park. But could you have picked a spot in the shade? Huh. Next time you drive and I do the drinking, I wonder why they haven't sounded the alarm yet. Yes, they appear to be ignoring us. Try to make it work for you. Okay, if I'm not back in ten minutes, give me ten minutes. Attention! Oh, <coughs> Bailey for deck! Division. Halt! Yes, yes sir, sir Oh, yeah. I mean that. <clears throat> well done. Looking good. Just don't move. Oh, crap. Four of them. Uh, <laughs> in the... Attention! Bailiff on deck! <laughs> Hello? Bailiff on deck! Yeah, we've noticed. Tell us something we don't know. Really? Mind your manners, will you? A little more respect for our bailiff. <laughs> yeah. He's got a point. After all, he's the bailiff. <laughs> Yes, exactly. I'm, 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 I'm the bailiff. Uh, remember that. And is this the right floor, bailiff? You should know that, being a bailiff and all. Ah. <laughs> 
<laughs> of, of course. Uh, of, of course. Are you completely sure about that? Of course I'm sure. I'm the bailiff. I'm always sure. Good to know. Time to disembark, everyone. The bailiff says we're here. Um, uh, yes. Oh, Cletus? No. Argus. You guessed it. And you must be Rufus. Some nerve you've got coming here. Foolhardy and stupid. As always, or don't you realize that I will now have to break every single one of your bones? Wait! Can't we come up with a, a more peaceful solution? I don't think so. The time for amicable agreement has expired. I've been looking forward to this day. Put them up! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, cut it out! What happened here? A throttle valve to adjust the elevator speed. Oh, look at that kind of thing. Ow! Ah. Oh. Oh, cut it out! Waiting impatiently. Well, waiting? For your speech, of course. And allow me to add that I am no less excited myself. Your speeches are always so inspiring, so eloquent. You play the crowd like a, a virtuoso plays his piano. And if I may say so, a less charismatic orator would literally be torn to pieces by such an audience. <laughs> he would. Oh, certainly. But your words are like magic. Inimitable. <laughs> but here I am, just raving on. You should get started before the crowd grows even more agitated. Yeah, yes, nobody wants that. Electrify us. Work your magic. Guys, uh, just a moment. I, I, I think, um... Gentlemen, we are about to be addressed by our great role model. Our leader. Our mentor, our idol, Bailiff Argus, who just a moment ago personally assured me that the speech he's about to deliver will inflame your hearts for our common cause. And now, stand to attention! You are now being addressed by... Bailiff Argus! He knew this, and he just let me walk into it. What an ass! Um... Yeah, Tom. What a... Well, I mean, that... Ass... I don't know. What I'm trying to say is... That, 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 um, us. Uh, right here by my side is a fine example of our organization. The Organon is an organization of asses. That's how we were constructed. That is our destiny. I know, I know. Why is he saying those things? Well, this is why. Just look around. What are we actually doing here? We're supposed to destroy a planet. For which we don't give a rat's ass. For people who don't mean shit to us. Isn't it time to realize that we are the asses here? 
Then why don't we do what is expected of us? And shit on them! Come on, say it! We don't give a shit! I could name you a thousand more examples. The fact is, we're the asses here. But is that something to be ashamed of? I say, no! I, for my part, am proud of what I am. I am an ass! And you're all asses too! It's time to show the world what's inside us! Long live the Organon! <laughs> Was it good? Very inspiring, like always. Great. Well, then I can go now. Uh, which way to the bridge? But, sir, uh, what about the hymn? The hymn? Exactly. Following each of your speeches, you lead us in our hymn. You can't have forgotten. Uh, uh, yes. The hymn. <laughs> <coughs> Me, 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 me. <laughs> Here we go. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, oh. Organon. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, oh. Organon Organon Oh Organon Oh Oh 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 Organon Organon Oh, Organon Oh, oh Organon Organon Oh, Organon Oh, oh Organon Organon Oh, Organon Oh, 
Organon Organon Oh Organon Oh Oh Organon Organon Oh Organon Oh Oh Organon